We built 90 location pages for our home services client in Los Angeles. What are you working on today? The glorious job of location pages. You're doing location pages? Yeah. For who? Twin Home Plumbing out in California. And how many have you done so far? I have done about 50. 50? No, no, sorry, sorry. <laughs> there's 50 overall. I've done about 30. Okay, cool. And tell our, tell our viewers a little bit about what location pages are, why they're important. So location pages are individual pages for a company that services like a whole city. And you make a location page for every town in that city so that this company will rank for that town in that city. So it helps gain SEO, like traction, and really helps companies rank higher than the other ones because the more content you have, the higher chance you have of ranking on the SERP, which is the search engine result page. Wow. That's, that sounds like it's straight out of Moz Academy. Uh, yeah, well, straight practice. So those are the, all the locations that you're making? Yep, in Los Angeles County. Wow. So it sounds like Twin Home's getting their money's worth. Twin Home is definitely getting their money's worth. Easily. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Yeah. Well, you know, and this, this is really what helps clients, you know, rank at the end. This is pretty much not the only thing, but it helps a lot of new businesses get new customers. So. Yeah, absolutely. If you haven't watched the first episode, Twin Home Experts is a mold removal, remediation, plumbing, and leak detection company in Los Angeles, California, currently paying Developmark for monthly SEO services. The team hired us to implement on their SEO campaign and redesign their website to get more qualified leads and sales from internet marketing. Immediately after the website's launch, the website started getting more qualified form fills, calls, and visitor traffic with a decreased bounce rate to overall increase user experience, drastically performing the SEO service. Rewind. I'm Jim Schulke, Twin Home Experts, Los Angeles. It's uh, January 4th, Saturday morning, 8 o'clock. Uh, dude, I got to tell you, it's amazing. Our form fills through our website has increased 52% uh, since we've gone live with your site. Just super, super excited with this momentum. Um, the quality of the, the leads that are coming into the site are absolutely phenomenal. So just wanted to let you and uh, your team know, super, super excited. And I saw all those other pages uh, built out as well. So incredible job, super excited. Let's keep it going, thank you. So in this episode, we got down and dirty by creating over 90 location pages for the Los Angeles area in just four days. To start, Parker, our SEO tech, went in and found the highest income areas in Los Angeles to sort his SEO planning. From there, we added these keywords into a rank tracking tool that would allow us to see the month over month change for all locations. Naturally, the next step was to plan out the URL structure of the planning, so we all decided it would be best to do root domain slash service areas slash location name. Having a categorized URL structure allows you to add in keywords inside of your URL with avoiding Google's algorithm updates for keyword stuffing. So if you think about it this way, if you can categorize your URLs, you can get your keywords to show up when a visitor makes a search without going above and beyond Google's algorithm changes and trying to stuff keywords in. Since the site is so large, we had a great page structure for mobile and desktop for our internal linking process, giving the visitor a better experience overall, increasing the SEO rankings for each page. There's been a lot of talk online about user experience and page design and getting people to visit other pages on your website. In reality, when you look at pages like wikipedia.com, they have so much information on that website that their average session on the website is a lot longer than your typical website out there in the market. So creating these internal navigations, creating this internal link and creating content that's very similar on the website drastically increases rankings. And that's exactly what we did with the Twin Plumbing website. We have so much content on that website, people spend hours just clicking through and reading the information, especially if they're a qualified client. So user experience has a direct reflection on your search engine optimization score. So make sure that you're creating these internal links on the website and navigation on the website that gets people to click through. Parker went in and created unique content for each page, including H tags, text changes, title tags, meta description changes, and unique content per page. Our team also knows the importance of having great call to actions throughout each page. So for the desktop versions, we we added a form as well as images. For the mobile version, we thought click to calls and the form would be the best options to get potential customers to reach out to our client. Hey folks, I wanna take a moment here and give you the insight of this guy right here, which is the form fill. Now, we've seen a huge increase, in fact, a 52% increase of this form fill, but I wanna talk about the quality 
When someone goes and fills this out, the quality of the lead is much, much better. And I have to attribute that to the back end, which is all of the relevant content here. So if you've got good content, a fast website, you're going to capture a great homeowner that is going to be a good quality lead. Give you an example of what I mean by a good quality lead. This one just came in about uh, 20 minutes ago. And this is a guy that is desperate to use our services. And he basically says right here, I will pay you just to talk to you. I really need your help. Now, what I mean by that guys is this, if there is good relevant content to a homeowner, you've already built the trust, they're going to use you. Well folks, hopefully this gave you a little bit of an insight and some inspiration on making sure that you dominate with these form fields. What's going on, man? How's the location pages coming along? Uh, I'm almost done. Should be done by the end of the day. How many did you do? 88. So you've done 88 location pages? I'm going to do 88. I've probably done about 70. 70, so we'll be done about tomorrow. Yeah, easily. Okay, cool. How are your fingers feeling? Uh, they're actually surprisingly good. Are you stretching them out? I am. I am. I'm doing a lot of uh, copy and paste, so it's like minimize this time. Cool. Sounds good, man. It's all about time management. The cool part about these location pages when we made them is we created a service areas page that basically has all of them listed out that we're working on. So what was really cool about this is, is when you create location pages, uh, you got to have somewhere where they're all kind of already there. So when we make our Google search, when we go to look at some of these different types of locations like Bell Garden, CA, Mold Removal, um, you can see that almost every single page, I haven't checked every single one of them, but almost every single page that we've added to this website that Parker done in, in terms of locations is ranking on the first page of Google. This means that whenever somebody goes in and they type in Bell Garden CA mold removal, our client site is gonna be ranking on the first page for this phrase and pretty much for eternity as long as we keep working on it. And the same thing is with several pages. So we tested several pages, right? This is Baldwin Park uh, CA mold removal, right? This is our new page right under Thumbtack and right over BHG, which has been here for some time now. So you can see that these pages are set up very properly and the meta descriptions have been optimized uniquely and the title tags have been optimized uniquely making these pages rank on the first page. And you know, I checked a bunch of other ones, I checked Burbank, right? So this is another area that we're trying to rank for. You can see that they're at the bottom of the page. But what's interesting with this is, as you can see, this URL structure, this is the old URL structure. This is twinplumbing.com slash location slash Burbank mold removal. Whereas our new structure, if you open this link, this is actually an old link on their website. You can see May 30th of 2019. This page, if you click on it, it actually redirects to our Burbank service areas uh, URL structure that we have now. So um, although this isn't at the top of the first page, it's because this is not a page that we built. Prior to us making the site, this actually uh, was a different type of page with a bunch of duplicate content. So once we redid the site, a lot of these keyword rankings shot up inside of the search engines, making it searchable. The same thing with Artesia, right? This is a number two. You can see we're right under the organic here, right above Home Advisor and Thumbtack. And this is service area slash Artesia CA. So this actually is ranking at the top here. Uh, and you can see Agora Hills. This is number one. Some of them are number one. Most of them are just at the top of the first page. Arcadia, you can see, is at the top of the first page. Um, so a lot of this stuff is awesome. You can see here Al Alhambra CA mold removal. This is at the top of the first page. So this this uh, service area is this location page structure that we do for these businesses really helps them rank at the top of the search engine for their target keywords. And I really quickly wanted to show you real results inside of the search engine since we've made these pages and we've worked on it in the past week. And there you have it, folks. That is the end of the video. Let me know if you like this video. Leave a comment, leave a like, leave a subscribe and hit the notification bell. If you want to watch more of this series, um, I have super fun time creating this project. We are nowhere near done creating and optimizing this project. So uh, we are in a 12 month agreement. So this is month two of our services. So uh, obviously we have a good 10 more months to go. So I will be flying out to see the client pretty soon. So we're going to continue the series and we're really going to try to get this website, you know, a 400% return on investment from the leads that we're generating online. And that can't be possible without the great team that I have over at Developmark. So Parker, if you're watching this, thanks for making that video. Uh, Jim, Dave, thanks for you guys for making that video. And I will see you guys in the next time. It is Saturday. It is early in the morning and I have dinner to go to with my girlfriend. I'm glad that I was able to pump out this information for you guys. I hope it was super helpful. Leave a comment down below. Let me know if it was helpful and I'll see you guys in the next video.